With the device locked, you may apply the orthosis to the patient's arm. With the strut running along the forearm and the tension spring positioned behind the elbow, slide the hand, thumb up, through the molded cuffs. Align the device so the center of the tension spring cover lines up with the joint axis of the elbow. The hand and wrist cuff should be aligned to cover both the palm of the hand as well as the end of the forearm. To provide a comfortable fit, the Advanced Supination Orthosis features a unique strut length adjustment capability. To take advantage of this feature, depress the leaf pin on either the distal or proximal strut of the orthosis and increase or decrease the length as needed. Adjust the distal cuff to a length that positions the hand properly within the cuff. The proximal strut should not impinge on the medial axillary area. Note that extending the strut length beyond the last adjustment hole may cause the leaf pin to fall out of the strut. If this happens, reinsert the leaf pin into its housing and reconnect the two struts. After you've adjusted the struts, shape and mold the bendable contour cuffs to the patient's limb to assure a snug yet comfortable custom fit. Advance's unique contour cuffs are made of an aluminum insert and rubberized coating that enable you to bend and twist the cuffs easily. The blue memory foam pads, which are attached to the cuffs by Velcro, may also be repositioned or even trimmed and sized to maximize fit and patient comfort. Once you've adjusted and positioned the orthosis on the patient's arm, secure the straps. First, secure the proximal and distal straps. Then secure the middle strap on the arm. These straps can be attached loosely, since their purpose is to keep the stabilizing bars in place. However, the middle strap should be snug enough to allow one finger to be inserted between the strap and the skin. When the device is secure and the patient is comfortable, check for any neurological or vascular changes. The patient should not experience any numbness or tingling while wearing the orthosis.